Hello and greetings to the next Let's Play of my choice that is Final Fantasy IX. This game means a lot to me personally because I've played it a lot. I'm a Final Fantasy fan, I wouldn't say I'm a fanboy, but yes. Oi, 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 oi. People have no need to see an intro. Thank you. So yes, this is also a little test as you can see because things will look very, very different than usual, but... Just for a heads up, I would love to have your opinion on um, basically how everything looks as you see it and whatnot for the entire episode. If there's any improvements I could make, just anything at all. Oi, ah, screw you, intro. But yes, any feedback on this would be absolutely lovely and whatnot because I want to get better and whatnot, produce better content. And in my personal opinion, this is where it starts when it comes to sort of good stuff and whatnot. But yeah, anyway. Let's continue, or actually let's start, and any feedback would be lovely. Yes, welcome to Final Fantasy IX, and I will now shut my face. Sure is dark. Guess nobody's here yet. And let's welcome our first character to our game, who is originally known as Zidane, but I will be changing the name. And if we look around, there are two items in here. 47 gil. There should be a potion over here too. Yeah, there we go. One potion. And then it just tells you, like, the candle in the middle of the room, so sure, why not? Who's there? Through a wall, you can see the light. And yes, that's quite predictable. Um, I will be calling him Silver. S I L V E R. I haven't decided on names for anyone else yet apart from Zidane, so. This will be kind of interesting when it gets around to naming some of these characters. It's me, Silver. Aha, the whole gang's here. Hey, Silver, you sure are late. Sorry, so where's the boss? Ain't here yet. And we have this thing. Rather creepy looking. And whenever he wants to start, thank you. Game's a bit slow on loading battles, strangely, but hey, I ain't gonna complain. This is the masked man. And he has many an item to steal, just three to start with. Ooh, I've already got a potion, that's awesome. Can start him. The one great thing about this battle is, everyone here is a thief. So it's like everyone can just steal from him. And he's already knocked out one of my guys. 
There's a wrist. And there should be one more weapon that should be the Mage Masher. That should take five years to steal, knowing my luck. But hey. Come on. This is just getting... S I've... I know there's stupid steal rates in this game that people complain about it a lot because stealing plays a big part in this. It's like you can get an item, I think it's, you could roughly say half an hour to an hour earlier, possibly, depending how fast you play through the game. So it's like you can be learning abilities so on and so forth a lot faster. Steal. Steal. Screw it, I'll just steal with everyone. Oh, come on. Come on. Find it. Find that Mage Masher in his back pocket. It's in the back left pocket. Damn. They don't know their size. See, look. Silver knows where it is. Silver actually understands what I say. Now all you've got to do is just wail on him. And this is really the easy part. <laughs> Stealing is the actual most difficult thing, even though you do have four people for it. This fella doesn't have that much HP, uh, he only has about, I think, has 180 I believe. The info will be on the side of the screen, so I don't really need to be saying all of that, but yes. Oh, how unfortunate. Why should we go easy on you? You attacked us first and scared the living daylights out of us. Hey, fools. Why are we the fool? You attacked us. You're looking a lot better. Oh, well, thank you. <laughs> and that's a hell of a hearty laugh. All right, let's start this meeting already. Here's the plan. Tantalus, infamous brand daring thieves, that's us, is heading for the kingdom of Alexandria. You'd never have guessed. Our mission is to kidnap heir to the prince, heir to the throne, Princess Garner. I'll take it from here, so listen up. Our ship is about to dock at Alexandria, and when it does, we're gonna put on our costumes and perform. I want to be your canary. Oh. The most popular play in Alexandria. Break a leg, Marcus, because you're playing the lead. Leaving the action to me, of course, the real kidnappers. Be kidnappers will be blank and silver. Very awesome. I'll distract the audience from backstage with these little buggers. I can't stand oglops. Oglops are a type of insect, if you're wondering, but you'll find that out soon enough. But I'll manage, so don't worry about me. And that'll be your cue, Silver. Here you can select the Queen, and if you do it like 30 odd times, 30, 50 times, I'm not too sure, you'll actually get another scene where another member of the crew comes in and actually tells you off, basically, but I can't be asked to sit here for that, but that's just me. You bet you're going to kidnap the most babelicious beauty of all, Alexandria, Princess Garnet. And I'll now shut up for the rest of the intro.
Oh, poor little fella. Alexandria. Are you alright? Hey, you dropped your ticket. Bye bye. Okay, now the fun begins. Here we have, let me just go into the menu. An unknown mystery character. We could have gone into the menu before, but I completely forgot to do it. The main thing I want to do here is window color classic. I'm not a fan of the actual gray. I prefer the blue. That's just me personally. Um, battle speed fast. Field message fast. I would rather run. Um, active ATB. I think that's everything. But I need to change here. Sorry about the little interlude. But yes, here we have a mystery character. And we have about 20 to 30 items and amounts of gill we can actually pick up at this stage of the game. Oh, there's one. Here we have the zombie card. The card game will come into play later and I'll show that possibly in the next episode. I think I'll start that one. Heroin statue. This statue was built to commemorate General Madeline, who fought in the Ninth Limblum, Limblum War in 1389. At the tender age of 13, General Madeline fought against the Limblum army with only nine soldiers under her command. She died in 1401, well before her time. Damn. Oh, I think this is my next item. Potion. There is some items over the far side over here. What have we got here? A sh Sangan card. Do, 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 do. Oop, uh, there's my next one. This is my main card. And I believe that's all for this area. So let's continue on. There should be a potion. Oh, wait. slow down. Oh, oh, I just got hit. Why you get out of my way? Oh, lovely. There should be a potion around here. I compl uh, not too interested in you. Is this it? Yes, my potion. I believe I can go... Uh, no, I can't go in this shop. Oh, damn. Go back. I'm sure I missed a potion. There's normally two potions I can pick up at the beginning section. Let me go back. I'm not happy about this. Come on, where is it? Is this it? Yes! Oh, I'm silly to forget that one. Okay. Now what do we got here? I believe you're another card. Am I right? Nope, you're Gil. The card is over the other side of the screen. There we go. And if we go in here, I believe we have three more items. Oh, out of the way, there should be some gill here. Oh no, that's a potion. The other's gill. I'm getting completely confused here. I'm doing this so well. Plan card, and are you my gill then? Yes, there we go. 27 gill. How much do I have? 607. When you're ready, love. Thank you. And in the next area, we have no items out here, but there's an item in the item shop. You'd never have guessed, would you? We have some more gill. Uh, what items do I actually have? Do I need her to buy anything? 13 potions, high potion, phoenix down, phoenix pinion, remedy, tent, major measure of wrist. Can I actually equip him with anything? Wrist, that gives flea gill. That is something silver can learn, so there's no point in giving it to this little fella. So yeah, he's just learning fire at the moment. If you haven't guessed by now, he is the Black Mage. And on we go. And before we get on with the little bit of story we have here, I need to go over here. Ah, right on my way, kids. I believe my next item is here. Phoenix Pinion. Awesome. No, 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 go. Oh. Ah, you little kids. Little terrors. Okay. Oh! 
Fine, I'll get the one from here first. Ether. This one I always find tricky. Because if you go down the back here, without going to the other screen, you get a remedy. And as far as I know, these guys are closed. Yeah, same for the other shop next door. No weapon and armor, respectively. And the last thing to do in this area is to actually continue. Actually. Yes, yes, I do do this first. Peek in the booth. That says ticket, and I believe I have a ticket. Yes, uh, this is... Uh, what, uh, what's showing today? Tell me about Alexandria. Not too fast. We already know what's being on. Because we know the crew. What's this? There's something odd about this ticket. Why? It's another fake. I've seen so many today. No. Now, now, don't cry. I know how you must feel. Here, I'll give you these. Try, do try to cheer up, hmm? Goblin card, fan card, skeleton card. Talk to Alleyway Jack to learn more about cards. Good luck, lad. But yes, the card game I'm not doing till next episode. I'll possibly do this bit off screen because you can get some awesome cards from this skipping game. You, my ladies, are awesome and you have some great stuff. Blast it. Hey, you made me miss you, little klutz. What did I do? I tripped over. Uh, phew, that should do. Well, it's been a long day. So I'm just going to walk off and leave my ladder. Hey, you, shrimp. You're the one with the phone ticket, ain't you? Uh, you can say, are you alleyway Jack? So let's just go with this one. Do I look like that loser? <laughs> but I'll let you see the show if you become my slave. Uh, you have to say yes here. If you say no, you literally just continue on. Nothing happens. Is it clear? Yes, it's clear. Awesome. Engage according to mission parameters. This kid is rather strange. And rather strong. This is Alleyway Jack. But he will actually rob you if he goes anywhere near you. I believe we need to take a detour right now. Into the steeple. No. Uh, there's sure there's items right here. There's one. I drops. And there's one upstairs. Hello again. Okay. That's the little lady that helped me before with my ticket. Very nice. And I believe if we go down here, yes, the little girl has now left, so. Make, tell me if you see him, yes, thanks. Damn! Kid went back inside. Did the kid go back inside, or am I just imagining things here? Yeah, the kid went back inside. Okay, let's try this again. Oh, don't tell me I missed my chance. Oh, that's not fair. Uh, I missed my three gill. I want my three gill. Now we're going to climb up this tower. I would never have guessed. It's very dangerous. You go first. Oh, thanks. Before we go anywhere, there should be items. Item number one. A tent. If we go over here, there should be item number two. Oh, God. There it is. Another potion! Ow! Ah, what the heck is that? Sorry about that, Koopo. It's Koopo! He's a muggle. Koopo! And this is slave number one. Try to get along, okay? Koopo, pleased to meet you. Sorry. I enter you in Muggle Diary. Okay. If you want to save the game onto memory card, if you want to save game onto memory card, just ask Moogles, Koopa. And you can regain health if you have a tank, Koopa. I understand. Not really, you're a bit of broken English, but hey, glad I can help. Alright, time for some upward mobility. A 
Okay, come on. Come on up, sleeve. Okay. Oh, it's Stiltskin. Kupo, you're here. Kupo, Stiltskin. Why that get up? You leaving, Kupo? Yeah, and this time I might be away for a long time. I'll miss you, Kupo. Now don't worry. All right. Okay, Kupo. Well, I'm off. Take care. Oh, and say hi to Mosh in the castle for me. I'm guessing Mosh is another boogle. Was that a friend of yours? Yes, Kupo. Very special one, Kupo. Hey, slave, I thought I ordered you that beer. Fine, fine, fine. Time to make a record. Mognet. I'll tell you about Mognet. Mognet is a mail delivery system between Moogles. We can send and receive letters to uh, send and receive letters to and from Moogles in other locations, Cooper. But delivery has been very sporadic lately. So I want you to help us deliver mail, Cooper. Sure, why not? I have a favour to ask, Cooper. Could you deliver a letter to Monty? Yeah, sure. Thanks, Cooper. Uh, I might as well save it while I'm at it. Slot one. And for a test episode, just seeing how things are, because I'm after your feedback and whatnot, guys and girls, I will actually leave it here as I've been playing for 20 minutes. I think that's a fair length for a first episode. I did plan about half an hour, but I want to be able to go back and do the skipping, so on and so forth. So yes, I will leave you people to your fun, and I will see you in the next episode, and I can't wait to hear your feedback, good or bad, for that is. For any matter. So yes, thank you very much and see you in the next episode.